You know, at the airport, we have hundreds of small structures to the big buildings and um, runways, taxiways, and highways, and uh, roadways also. Each piece has its own lighting challenges and lighting requirements. So uh, to fulfill that, uh, we do different um, energy uh, program to, the, to change the lightings or to, to replace the lamps itself. So we change almost uh, 6,000 T8 lamps with LED. It's a low cost, first of all. It's a marginal cost of any full fixture change. Um, but it gives the same energy conservation, long life, and the brighter light. So the, throughout the life of that uh, lamp, it gives the exact same amount of light. Uh, so this is the baggage area for, for Terminal 1. So as you have seen that we have done a lot of lighting upgrades for passenger experience purposes. But our employees are also the same important because they are spending their most of the day here. So we made this area very bright uh, by changing the lights, T8s. And we are doing that for all of our employees as well as all baggage areas by this year. We are at Terminal 3 apron. And if you can see behind me is the apron light uh, recently done as a part of Terminal 3 energy project. Within this project, we are looking to change 100% of Terminal 3 lights to LED. Our POA is already 100% LED. This apron lights especially is the first of that kind in our whole of our airport. And um, that's five times longer life, much brighter. And we are looking forward to this because um, as our airport's growing uh, faster, we need much less impact on our operations. So these lights help us to do that. And today I have only shown you the lighting projects, but overall energy conservation programs um, so far saved us about 20 million kilowatt hours, which is almost to 2,400 Ontario homes. And um, the program, we are taking it to uh, 75 uh, million kilowatt hours. Uh, savings, which is um, approximately 9,000 Ontario homes.